Vaporstone UK Limited and Vapor Canada Incorporated introduce the new Intelligent Door System proposed for use by London Underground Limited. This unique system will provide consistent, safe and reliable operation over its projected 40-year design life. It will feature improved passenger interface, reduced maintenance and consequently reduced life cycle costs. Each door operating system and its associated hardware is designed to open and close one pair of external sliding door leaves or a single door leaf. During the open and close cycle, the program door velocity profile is maintained with exceptional accuracy, regardless of any change in friction. The system is controlled by a triad structure, consisting of a central processing unit, a motion control processor, and a complex programmable logic device. With this design, no single fault can cause an unsafe condition, as each element checks the operation of the other two. It's important to note that the microprocessor does not directly control the motor driving the doors, as the single motor control feedback loop is contained within the motion control processor, which is hard-coded. The ability of the intelligent door system to differentiate between friction and a genuine obstruction is an important consideration in terms of station dwell times and nuisance cycling. It's designed to ignore friction and only stop when a genuine obstruction is detected during both the door open and door close cycles. The intelligent door system can be configured to react in a number of ways when an obstruction is detected to meet customer operating requirements and can easily be reprogrammed to alter its operating characteristics. As the door closes to within 115 millimeters between seals, the pushback lock operates, preventing the doors from fully reopening but allowing retrieval of trapped objects. Very thin objects, not detected by primary obstacle detection, will be detected when a force is applied to free the object. Doors are fully locked and sealed only when the last car leaves the station. The doors cannot now be opened, even within the 115mm pushback region. A shunter access device operated by G-Door key allows automatic opening if power is available or manual unlock and finger access if power is unavailable. The doors are powered by a slimline brushed DC motor sealed to IP65 and currently in use on North American door systems. This drives a Teflon coated stainless steel screw via a hollow shaft and proven flexible coupling. Drive to the door panel is provided by a nylon floating nut and to the secondary screw via a second flexible coupling. The system has two-stage mechanical locks, which provide positive coupling for the 115mm pushback stage and a fully closed and locked stage as the train leaves the station. The doors run on a proven induction-hardened stainless steel linear shaft and bearings, as previously supplied on Central, Jubilee and Northern lines. The door panels are of a construction and design based on the central line doors, but will have a reduced door width as there is no door drive arm to accommodate. The panel will be approximately 30% lighter than similar existing panels, which will provide lower impact forces at higher door speeds. The panel mounted passenger push buttons are double sided and will be supplied with illuminating halos. The door panels will be provided with a deeper, more compressible seal, currently under development, giving improved obstacle detection and enhancing the pushback capability to allow removal of trapped objects. The size and location of the intelligent door system makes the space traditionally occupied by pneumatic underseat operators available for other equipment.